The next on the agenda, Mr. Kirk had asked to be put on the agenda to speak to the board. Good evening, Mr. Chairman and board members. I'm Neil Kirk, and I live on Mount Dearborn Road. I wish to address the board on the default budget that will be before the budgets a week from tomorrow, before voters a week from tomorrow. As a result of a superior court decision after the town meeting deliberative session, the selectmen removed about $60,000 from the default budget, representing new contract increases not, not previously approved by voters. Simultaneously, the selectmen revisited the default budget and increased it by approximately the same $60,000. This was accomplished by increasing lines such as insurance to the prior year's appropriation amounts, even though you know that lower amounts will be spent this year. At its meeting last week, the board suggested that these increases in the default budget were agreed to by both parties to the lawsuit, the town and me. That was not the case. There was no agreement of any kind. The town's attorney asked my attorney whether the town could increase the default budget and provided a list of the proposed increases. My attorney told the town's attorney that the statute gave the selectman authority based on, quote, relevant new information, unquote, that's the statutory language of RSA 4013, to change the default budget any time prior to the printing of the ballots. I don't believe the statute contemplated the loss of a lawsuit as, quote, relevant new information, unquote. So my question to you is this. What was the relevant new information on which you based your $60,000 increase in the default budget? I believe the voters of where deserve an answer. Thank you. Thank you. You don't wish to answer? No. Thank you. Next on our agenda, we have the minutes of uh, 2 26 18. 